previous video, we covered how we keep the body of the truck centered over the axle as the truck raises, raises and lowers, which is unlike any other suspension uh, system on the market that I'm aware of. So today, what I want to do is use this 450 to show you how the steering on a traditional truck works and then compare that to our any level truck and uh, show you how the steering works on that. So I'm going to climb under here and just talk through uh, pieces underneath this truck. Okay, so what we have here is the traditional means for steering a truck. You've got a gearbox up in here with a shaft that comes out of it. And as the steering wheel turns, it spins that shaft. That shaft has a pitman arm connected to it. And so as that shaft spins, this pitman arm is gonna move left to right, which the pitman arm is attached to this drag link. And the drag link is just a straight bar that comes from the pitman arm down over to the connection point over on the spindle. So what happens is, as that pitman arm turns, when the steering wheel is turning, those spindles are gonna move and your tires are gonna turn left and right because you've got this tie bar underneath here that's connected, connecting the two spindles together. So we'll, uh, we'll actually show you how that works here. Okay, so as the steering wheel turns to the right, that pitman arm's gonna swing, it's pushing that drag link and that spindle over there and turning the tires. Now when he comes back to the left, same thing happens, it's pulling from over there, it's pushing through this tie bar and setting the, the tires over to the left. So one other thing, a very important thing that I wanna cover while we're under this truck, and this is related to adjustable suspensions, or even if you're hitting bumps, right? Similar to the Panhard bar, the track bar that we talked about in a previous video. And if you haven't seen that, go go back and take a look at it because that's that's a very important to, piece of this whole puzzle. Um, but back to this this drag link, the steering bar, it is also a just a straight bar. So as the truck goes up and down, that bar is going to move in an arc. So that is going to um, it could cause you significant issues with your alignment that uh, typically is combated by trying to keep this bar as horizontal as possible. But uh, when you start getting into the bigger lifts or uh, adjustable suspensions, that uh, has huge downside to it. So we'll talk you through how, uh, how we address that with our any level products. So what we're looking at here is the steering wheel on an any level truck, with the truck fully lifted. And what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna lower the truck. Keep an eye on the steering wheel because I don't know of any other adjustable suspension system on the planet that can keep the steering wheel straight throughout th this adjustment range. That's what sets us apart. That is what allows this truck to be driven at any level, true ride height adjustment from your factory stock ride height all the way up to a 13 inch lift and any level in between without having to worry about your alignment. That's the difference with any level. Okay, so we're up here under the front of an any level truck now, so we can show you how our patented steering mechanism uh, does the job of keeping the steering wheel straight throughout our entire uh, 12 inches of ride height adjustment. And the way this works, this uh, has a long link and a short link. It's the same exact mechanism that we use for the Panhard bar, the track bar that we previously discussed, and it works the same exact way. Except the difference here is the way it's uh, connected to the truck and its function. This uh, long link here is connected up to the factory pitman arm, which is on the same gearbox, so all that stuff is factory but you've got this connection point here that goes down this long link to a slider that's on a mount that's connected to the tie bar. And this is allowed to slide here horizontally. And then the steering forces actually come from the pitman arm down to the center of this long link, down the short link and connect here at this tie bar mount. So you're really steering from over on this side of the truck. So 
This, again, just like the, uh, the pan heart or the track bar mechanism, folds up on itself, travels in a straight line from the pitman arm down to this tie, tie bar mount, and it's allowed to kick, kick out over here and slide on, on the passenger side. So as the truck goes up and down, that travels in a straight line and keeps your steering wheel straight. We'll, uh, we'll start the truck up. It's got 40 inch tires on it, so they're difficult to turn on a standstill, but we have a hydraulic steering assist on this truck that will make it easy for us to turn these tires. So we'll fire the truck up and we'll turn the tires left to right so you can see how this mechanism works as the tires turn.